today I answered strangers ads in Brookhaven and let me just say some of them were pretty weird bro what the heck Ugh, guys I am so bored today man I mean ugh, there's nothing to do poke isn't around and really man like I have done everything in Brookhaven lately bro like I feel like there's nothing I haven't hit and uh guys I can see this billboard in the distance that says hold on what the heck it says Bring cola to plot 24 equals money and plot 24 is right over there. Um, guys, should I go bring over a cola to that guy? I mean, like some guy just put up a random advertisement instead of going to the store to get his own cola. But hey, I got tons and tons of cola in the house. I can make a little money. You know what I'm saying? I even got one actually in my hand right now. I doubt you'd want this cola. I'm going to chug a cola at 100,000 subscribers, guys. So make sure you subscribe. Anyways, let's go give this guy some cola and see how much money we can make. All right, guys. As you know, I have a lot of cola. So I'm just going to stock up right now. Bring this guy. I don't know how many he's really looking for. But I'm going to bring him like, I don't know, like 12 or something. Okay. I got 12 colas in my pocket. Easy peasy lemon cola squeezy. Let's go give this guy some cola and make a little moolah. Some money, guys. I'm in. All right, let's get the heck over there. Bring cola to plot 24. That's plot 24 right here, guys. All right, well, we're just going to pull up and be like, hey, man, ding dong, cola time. All right, guys, I see him inside right now. Oh, um, I see someone in there, guys. And yo, there he is. This must be the cola guy. I said hello. Haha, <laughs> I really like this guy, bro. Maybe me and him can be friends because, you know, he seems to really like cola. So what's up? Yo, man, I got the stuff. I'm answering your ad. You know, I'm the cola plug. You're a lifesaver. All right, bro. Well, here you go. I, I got a whole bunch of them for you here. Ready? I'm just actually going to put them all in a bag. Okay, I got the whole dozen right here. You got the money? Oh, sweet, bro. Wait, how much money did you give me? Okay, one... Uh, what comes after one? There's $50 right there. 50 bucks? Are you kidding me? All I did was walk Cole up the hill from my house to his, bro. Thanks again. No, thank you, bro. Guys, that was the quickest and easiest $50 I've ever made in my life, bro. You know what I should do? Is start answering more ads in Brookhaven. I bet I can make a ton of money. Okay, let's go find another billboard. 50 bucks. Oh, yeah. I made 50 freaking dollars, guys. I mean, I might as well be the rich person in Brookhaven, bro. Like, Wolfpack, watch out. I might come and buy some of the game up. Woo! Guys, literally $50. I mean, do you know how many goals I could buy for 50 bucks, bro? I mean, that guy literally got kind of, like, ripped off almost, I feel like. But, I mean... Hey, I'll take it. It's kind of like a tip, you know? But anyways, guys, there's got to be more strangers ads for me to answer in Brookhaven and make a little more money, you know? And there's actually the billboard over here right now. And wait, do you guys see what that says? It says, wanted fake boyfriend at plot 11 or maybe it's best friend fake boyfriend fake best friend you know what guys it's a risk i'm willing to take because i see a lot of dollar signs over there and that means i can make a lot of money maybe even more than 50 bucks bro i mean could you believe that would you actually believe someone could pay me more than 50 dollars to do something i mean not me all right well i'm gonna go over there right now plot 11 easy peasy bro i made 50 bucks today i made 50 bucks today all right, guys, pulling up on plot 11. It's right over here, guys. And yeah, looks like we're going to get to figure out if I'm going to be a best friend or a boyfriend. But either way, <laughs> I could do either. All right, guys, going to ring the doorbell. I mean, <laughs> Todd, put your money away, bro. Stop flexing, all right? All right, let's ring the doorbell and see what we're working with here. I see a girl coming down. Okay. Hey there, uh, I'm here about the ad. Hi, you're here about the ad, huh? Well, that's perfect. You're actually perfect for me. I can actually see this going amazing. Come on inside, please. Uh, guys, um, I'm actually kind of a little nervous about this one. All right, she's inviting me inside. All right, she's probably really, really nice, and there she is standing there right now. So, uh, what is it that, um, I'm exactly doing here? Well, it's a funny story, but I need a boy to go with me to a family dinner, you know, with me to meet my parents and stuff. Okay, so it, it, it is a boyfriend, guys, bro. She needs me to be like her fake boyfriend to meet her parents? Uh, listen, ma'am, I don't know if that's really like the best idea, you know, lying to your family and parents about like being in a relationship with, I mean, me. What? No, you're, you're perfect. You are perfect. <laughs> Oh my god, what the heck? Hey, excuse me, ma'am. Okay, we just met. Please do not do that. Uh, I need a little personal space. Um, so you're saying, let me, okay, hold on, lady. Please, 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 okay. We're gonna come over here. I need, I'm a little claustrophobic in the hallway, okay? Please, give me five feet. Thank you. Jeez. All right, lady, listen. I will do it, but... What? Oh my god, the way! But, 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 okay, hold up. Big butt here. How much are you gonna pay me? You know, guys, I mean... <laughs> 
job like this I can't do for cheap. I mean, I'm gonna be lying, like pretending to be her boyfriend, bro. This girl seems a little like crazy, bro, already. So, I mean, I'm gonna need a pretty penny. It is not gonna be cheap getting my service. I'm telling you, lady, you're gonna have to really put that price high. I mean, the last guy paid a lot and it was <laughs> just for cola. How does $60 sound? <laughs> Six, $60. Really? That sounds amazing. I'll do it, but I'm gonna need the money up front. No, no money till after dinner. Got it? You need to make sure that you're doing a good job, okay? If my parents don't believe that you're not my only my boyfriend, I'm gonna lose my mind, and I'll freak out. I'm gonna take you down with me. Uh, <clears throat> guys, something's telling me I've uh, already made a big mistake. So when are we going to meet your parents? I'm warning you, don't do anything funny, okay? Okay. We have to leave right now. Let's go. Okay, guys. Well, I guess I'm going on this date with this girl. I mean, she is paying me 60 whole dollars, so that's pretty good, bro. Wait, you can't wear that. Huh? What do you mean I can't wear this, bro? This is what I'm wearing. There's clothes for you in the bathroom. Go get changed. Oh, man. Are you kidding me? Guys, what the heck is this outfit? Come on, guys. Are you kidding me? Like, I might need 65 bucks. You look perfect, but we have to go now, okay? Okay, well, wish me luck, guys. All right, guys, well, we are off. I don't even know where the heck we're actually going to have dinner with her parents or anything like that, or it's a family party or something. I, I really don't even know, bro. I'm more worried about this dang sweater I gotta wear, and those must be her parents. Well, guys, wish me luck. If they're anything like her, this is going to be a long dinner. Hey, I have someone I'm watching to me. Uh, is this your boyfriend? Hi, and who is this? Uh, hi there. Yeah, my name is Todd, and uh, I'm dating your daughter. Hey, watch, watch it. Watch those hands. It's nice to meet you, Todd. Ha! Huh, for a second, we thought you were fake. Uh, no, I am definitely real. And it looks like you two are very close. My Lord has had some issues with boys in the past. He's real, Mom. He's all mine, too. Oh, my God, guys. What the heck? Yeah, so please take care of her. Now let's go eat. Guys, what the heck was she talking about when she said that she had issues with boys in the past? Uh, hello? Uh, guys, should I just, should I just run right now? Uh, no, she'll chase me. All right, let's go. Guys, this is so awkward. Like, I'm literally at dinner with this girl and her parents pretending to be her boyfriend, and I think she might actually like me. So, when did you two meet? Oh, uh, you know. Todd and I are in love. Oh, yeah, we, <clears throat> gosh, guys, this is so weird. Uh, yeah, we're in love, all right. Hence the matching I love you sweaters. We're getting married, actually. What? 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 What did you say? Right, Toddy Boo. Uh, married? Yeah. Uh, yeah, we're... Oh, guys, it just got hot in here, bro. Um, <clears throat> yeah, we're getting married. Really? You are? We're gonna be grandparents. Lauren, listen, I didn't agree to any of this. He, he, he's the best, and I get him all to myself. This is quite surprising, but I can tell you both love each other, so I give my blessings. I'm so happy for you two. Guys, um... I think I might have to back out of this one. I don't know if $65 is worth really lying to this lady and getting married to this girl for. Why wait? You should get married today. T today? Oh, I think that's a great idea. Uh, Lauren, can I uh talk to you for a second privately? Listen, Lauren, I didn't agree to get married or anything with you, okay? I thought this was a one-time get dinner date type of thing. Fake it and lie. I don't re I don't really know what the heck I thought this was going to be. But like, bro, I we're not getting married, okay? Are you out of your mind? What are you talking about? You and I are in love. We're getting married, Todd, okay? Don't you know that? You're stuck with me now, forever. You answer that ad. You want that 65 bucks? You better get married to me. Wait, did you say 65 bucks? I thought it was 60. Uh, no, I still can't do it, okay? I'm not getting married to you. You're gonna regret this. What? What do you mean I'm gonna regret this? Uh, she's going back over to her parents right now. Mom, Dad, Todd and I are getting a divorce. What? what? How could this be? Guys, they're all swarming me right now. What the heck? Listen, your daughter and I were never even actually dating, okay? I don't want to have to say this, but she lied and faked the whole thing. She hired me so that I could pretend to be her boyfriend. I thought you were going to take care of her. Don't lie to me. He made me think he loved me. You're the worst. Guys, I'm starting to think that I should, uh, head out of here, bro. What the heck? That is definitely not worth $60, bro. I mean, jeez, I can answer some ads in Brookhaven that are way less stressful than that. All right, well, I mean, I don't have my clothes, bro. I left them inside that girl's house. Uh, you think I could go over there and get them real quick? Mm, yeah, I can't be walking around in this. I love you sweater all day. All right, guys, I got my clothes back. And you know what? I was thinking about it. Answering random billboards is a hit or miss. So what I decided to do is post my own ad, bro. Pretty much doing like a reverse ad saying if someone needs something, call me, all right? And I will come and do whatever it is that you need me to do, bro. Need something? Call Todd. I mean, boom, bam, bing. I will do it. Show up. Do a good job or at least try my hardest. 
And uh, yeah, I guess we just let that sit, cook a while, and uh, I'm gonna head back over to my crib. And maybe someone will call me or hit me up for something in the meantime. Alright guys, well I'm back in my own crib, waiting, just doing some chores of my own, you know, I mean, I'm answering everyone else's ads, but I got things to do back at, you know, Cribbo Day Todd. And so far, I mean, I've just been chilling, bro, cleaning up my yard, I mean, it's starting to look really, really nice around here, and... Wait, I'm getting a call right now, actually. Hello, this is Todd. Hey man, I need a ride, ASAP! Oh, you need a ride, alright, well I can pick you up, uh, where are you currently located? I'm at the Brookhaven Bank. Guys, what is that noise in the background? You gotta come quick though, and I'll pay top dollar. If you're here in the next 30 seconds, I'll pay you $5,000. $5,000? Alright, bro, I'm on the way. I'll see you in one second. Look for the white golf cart. Oh my god, guys. That's the most money I think I've ever heard about in my entire life. $5,000? I mean, that's like one, two, like a lot times $50. Alright, guys. I'm pulling up. I hope they're gonna be alright with me pulling up in the golf cart. I gotta trim the speed on this thing, bro. I mean, this guy is waiting for me. Alright, guys. I'm almost at the bank and uh, I don't see anyone outside yet, um, but I will just wait and some sort of alarms going off in there Um, I'm starting to get a bad feeling about this. Go 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 go. What the heck? Oh uh, guys Did I just hope these guys robbed the bank? I didn't want to be their getaway driver. No, no, no I am not gonna be your guys's getaway driver. This is ridiculous and what the heck guys? There's cops behind us. Oh my god. Ah! Oh guys, we gotta go, bro. I didn't want to be involved in this whole thing, and now I'm literally committing a crime, bro. I'm like committing a felony pretty much. We just robbed the Brookhaven Bank, and I'm helping these two guys get away with it. Oh, he just put out a gun. No! Oh my god, guys, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I gotta get out of here. Maybe I could lose him, and I can't get involved in this whole thing, bro. I can't go back to jail. Okay, we're just gonna keep driving through the field. Hopefully the cop doesn't catch us, bro, or maybe we'd lose him or something, man. If we go down, you will too. What are you talking? talking about i had nothing to do with this guys i'll lose him all right guys i'm gonna have to do some driving that i've never done before i've never really evaded the police before but i have an idea okay guys you know what my idea is i'm gonna drive in circles for a couple seconds and then on the count of three i'm gonna get out and just book it bro okay ready three two one ah! all right guys i didn't do anything ah wait Wait, he's chasing after me? Wait, no, why are you chasing after me? The criminals are over there. I didn't do anything. Please, please don't shoot me, please. Guys, what did I do? I didn't deserve this. I'm gonna have to make a run for it, guys. I didn't want to have to do this, but... Wait, is that Simon? Simon, it's me, bro. It's Todd. You're under arrest. Freeze. No, I can't go to jail. I'm not going to jail, bro. I gotta take Simon's cop car, and I'm getting the heck out of here. Ah! Whoa, guys, I didn't mean to do that. I just committed like like six felonies right there, bro. I'm definitely going to Brookhaven Jail or I'm going to be wanted or something. But all right, I got to ditch this cop car. Now that I'm away from Simon, I'm going to ditch that cop car. And, you know, I'm just going to go back to answering ads. All right, guys, I am done with all of the crazy ads. All right, I'm not going to be pretending to be anyone's boyfriend or committing like, you know, police chases and bank robberies. This ad is going to be super chill, bro. The ad that I'm currently answering is I'm going to be helping helping someone blind watch a Brookhaven movie, bro. And I'm just going to be narrating and kind of like explaining to them like, you know, what's going on in the movie so that they can enjoy it too. And he's over here right now, guys. There he is. He's got a sign out that says Todd. And, you know, I'm just going to walk up to him right now. Hey, Todd. Oh, guys, this guy must have like insanely good hearing because I didn't even say anything yet. How did he know it was me? Hey, Jake, how's it going? Glad you could make it. I've been hearing great things about this movie. I'm so excited. Thank you for helping me watch it. Of course, Jake. Let's get in there right now. We don't want to miss a second of it. See, guys, I like helping people and doing something good, bro. I mean, this guy, he can't see. And you know what? I'm going to volunteer some of my time, bro, to, you know, just kind of, like, help him. Uh, you know, obviously, he's paying me. All right, guys, we're going to get in here right now. And he walked right up to the line like he knew exactly where it was. This guy must be here all the time. Probably is the whole place mapped out in his head. There's some little kid. He just got his ticket in front of us. All right. He's probably going to enjoy the movie, too. Thanks. Oh, it's you? Uh, guys, apparently this little kid knows Jake here. Hey, Jake, you want to introduce me to your friend? Huh? Haha, <laughs> who's this? You poor sap. Uh, did he just say that to me, bro? What the heck? Buzz off, kid. Two tickets, please. That'll be $10. All right, guys, well, you know, this guy is definitely, you know, gonna pay because I'm here to watch the movie with him, bro. I mean, I shouldn't be paying, like, to be honest, but... Let's see. Oh, uh, man. Oh, what's going on, Jake? 
I think I forgot my wallet. Well, guys, you know, that does kind of make sense. I mean, he is blind, and it's probably kind of hard to find your wallet if you don't know where it is. I'm going to take a wild guess. So, so, is it okay if you cover it and I pay you through, like, an app later? Oh, yeah, definitely. I got you, bro. Don't worry. You can always pay me back on top of, you know, what you're going to owe me for watching the movies, of course. You said 20? Uh, yes, sir. <sighs> Uh, okay, well, here you go. I don't know why you said it like that. Can I get some popcorn, too? Dude, I just I just paid, but, uh, yeah, give him some popcorn, too, you know? Oh, uh, sure. Here you go, man. Thanks. Guys, everyone's acting so weird around this Jake guy, bro. He said, let's go to our seats. Wait, how the heck does he know where our seats are? Bro, are you kidding me? This guy literally must have this place, like, literally memorized by heart. He knows exactly where he's going. He's not even bumping into anything, bro. And he just walked right up to his seat, bro. I mean... How would he know what seat that we're in if he can't read or see his ticket, man? All right, well, anyways, this is my seat. Oh, not that one. This is my seat sitting right next to Jake and uh, that little kid from earlier. All right, Jake, so you want me to explain what's going on? Bro, I love this part. What are you talking about you love this part, bro? I thought you haven't seen this movie before. Oh, yeah. Uh, what, what are they doing? Well, Mr. Brookhaven is literally outside right now with a gun, and he is literally infiltrating the base of the agency, bro. Whoa, that's cool, man. I totally did not know that. You know you're being played like a fiddle, right, bro? Hey, who said that? Guys, that little kid behind me is talking to me. Oh, uh, what are you talking about, kid? Hey, kid, shut the heck up! What the heck's going on here? I thought you said you didn't know that kid. No, I'm tired of seeing you drag people around fooling them into thinking you're blind. You're not really blind? What the heck? Who does something like that? You're a fake. Um... Hey, bro, you owe me $25 for that popcorn and movie ticket. And the 100 bucks you promised me for watching the movie with you. Oh, whoa, whoa, you're not going anywhere, buddy, all right? Back up. Back up, okay? He just removed his glasses. Dude, look. I'm caught, okay? I'm not blind. I'm sorry. You make me sick. Who pretends to be blind to take advantage of people, bro? I mean, what the heck's wrong with you? And... Wait. That little kid just said, his wallet's right here. Oh, and he just grabbed all of his money. Here. Dude. You are the GOAT, bro. Thank you so much. How much money we got here? 100, 150. You know what? I'm going to take it all, bro. That's what you get for being a lying, manipulating piece of butt. Come on, really? You stink, bro. Yeah. By the way, this movie sucks. Thanks, kid. Here, let's split it. Thanks, man. I'm out of here, guys. Jeez, guys. I mean, I tried to do something nice and help a blind person watch a movie. You know what? I mean, I'm the one that got taken advantage of, bro. Are you kidding me? What the heck? And wait. Is that who I think it is? The girl from earlier. She just said, oh, Todd, where are you? Um, oh, uh, crap, guys. Uh, hey, man, I think that girl's looking for you. Oh, uh, crap, bro. She can't know I'm here. Hide, bro. I got you. Okay, I'll hide right here. Crap, okay. Guys, oh, my God, that's that crazy girl from the date I went on earlier. This guy's covering for me. How can I help you? Have you seen the cutest boy in the world? Uh, nope, haven't seen him. Here's what he looks like. Guys, what am I going to do if she catches me back here? I'm going to have to bolt. I know he's here. I smell him. Uh, she smells me, guys? I mean, she did take a really good smell of me when I was in her house, bro. Crap. That must be the popcorn you're smelling. <laughs> Actually, you know what? I did see him. What are you doing, bro? No, please don't sell me out. What? Really? Yes, he's uh, upstairs hiding in the gym. Go quick. Well, why didn't you say so sooner? Dad! Oh, my God, bro. Thank you so much. I got to get the heck out of here. I'm out, guys. I'm out. I can't let that crazy girl find me again, bro. And I'm still wanted from the police for stealing a cop car, I bet. Oh, wait, guys. I'm getting a call right now. Hopefully not about another ad. Hello? Hey there. I saw your ad. Yeah, man. Uh, listen, I'm not really interested in doing any more ad. I'll pay you $10,000 if you come help me with some photography. Uh, what the heck does that mean? I just need a model for some pictures. Ten grand for some pictures? That's it? Yep. Plot 28. Come quick. All right, guys. I mean, all right. Plot 28. I got to go get some pics. Uh, I feel a little goofy in this outfit. Are, are, you, are you sure about this? What kind of photographer are you again? Quiet. I'm a wildlife photographer. Okay, but then why the heck am I here? I need practice. Now put on the head. Uh, I don't really want to put on the... Put on the head now! Okay, fine. Quack. Guys, you got to be kidding me. Good. Now hold still. Cool for me. Uh, cool, cool. Uh, cool. What the heck, guys? Ah, I don't know if all the money in the world is worth getting paid to do this, bro. But, I mean, he did say $10,000 and... Now fly! Fly, my birdie! Oh, uh, uh, crap, guys. Okay, I'm flying, all right. Oh, this is so embarrassing. Hopefully no one sees me. Make me believe you're a bird. Uh, okay. Um, yeah. Caw! Caw! Oh, guys, what is this? I don't really know if I should do this anymore. Okay, uh, how many more pictures of me do you need like this? 
Keep going. Next, we shall do a duck. Uh, what the heck, guys? The police just pulled up, and it's Simon. Uh, <coughs> cool, cool. Don't mind me. Just a bird over here. He said, hello there, mister. Hello, officer. We're looking for a criminal. He's associated with a bank robbery earlier this morning. What does he look like? Uh, well, guys, luckily I got this pigeon outfit on. Definitely not a, definitely not a giant pigeon, you know? Blue shirt? Pink shorts? Brown hair? Uh, crap, guys. Where's a backwards cap? Wait a second. Uh, crap, guys. They don't know it's me, do they? Sounds like my little birdie. Uh, no, uh, cool, cool. Mr. Bird, could you come over here for a second? Oh, crap, guys. What do I do? Uh, oh, hi there. Anything I can help you with, officer? Could you please remove your head, please? Uh, yeah, um, uh, sure, no problem. Uh, how's that? <laughs> the heck is this face? Uh, see, officer, this is uh, what I look like. Definitely don't match any descriptions. And that bird head too, sir, please. Oh, uh, this one? I didn't even notice it was on. Oh, guys, crap. What am I gonna do? I can't let him know it's me. I have to make a run for it. Oh my god, look! He's over there! Ah! I gotta get the heck out of here, guys. Oh, guys, this is the second cop car I've stolen in the same day. What the heck am I gotten into? Oh my god, I'm driving through the trees. I gotta go. <laughs> Guys, they got their own code for that? Oh my god, this must happen more than you think. I gotta hide. I gotta ditch this cop car. Probably in the same spot like I did last time. And... Okay, I'm out of here, bro. No one's gonna know it's me because I'm a pigeon. But, ah, crap. I gotta get the heck out of this outfit so I can blend back in. Whew. Guys, I never thought that today I would be running away from the police and, you know, this crazy girl in my pigeon outfit. But I have to go and... Oh, I can't go that way, guys. The police are blocking me off, and I gotta go this way. It's the only way. And there's a car coming in. I recognize that car from earlier. It's that crazy girl. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I gotta... There they are, bro. I'm trapped. I'm literally trapped, bro. Todd, come back to me. I'm caught, guys. No. Back off, cops. He's mine. Take off the pigeon head. Now, and what the heck? Okay, it's me. I give up. I didn't want to get involved in any of this. I promise. I didn't even rob the bank. No one is taking Todd from me. Hey, what the? Ah! Oh my God, guys. I don't know what the heck's going on. Guys, she's literally shooting at the police right now. Get in. Get in the car now. Oh my God, guys. What the heck? Oh no, guys. What the heck? 